Hey guys, it's Jack Jack and welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I am doing a clean with me. So we are going to be cleaning the house together. So hopefully this gives you guys some motivation to tidy up and get cleaning. I was debating back and forth if I should upload this on my vlog channel or my main channel, but I decided to upload it here on my main channel. So I hope you guys enjoy. I really let this house go. So last week I went to San Francisco and I was only gone for three days, but I don't know, my body is just not, I'm not a traveler, my body doesn't react well with traveling so every time I get back from a trip, doesn't matter how long or short it is, my body just kind of hibernates and I just don't do anything and so the whole week after coming back from my little three day trip to San Francisco, I didn't do any cleaning, I really let the house go and it just got super super dirty so I decided today we're gonna change all that, we're gonna tidy everything, clean everything up because also when the house is clean I feel more productive and motivated to get work done. When the house is dirty, I don't do anything. So today we're gonna be cleaning, I hope you guys enjoy. I'm gonna do a voiceover throughout this video to walk you guys through and tell you what I'm doing. So hope you enjoy the video and without further ado, let's go ahead and get started and get cleaning. So here is a little before of the entire mess that I've made in this apartment. I just, I didn't even care to tidy up or anything for a full week. Didn't make the bed, the laundry is piled up. We have so much laundry just in piles all over the apartment that I need to do. Um, the countertop in the bathroom is a disaster. My workspace, you can't even see the tabletop. And then in the kitchen, or like this is the dining room area, there's so much junk just laying on the floor that I need to put away. And then the dishes, I haven't done in several days. I'm, it's bad, you guys, this is bad. And I normally don't let the house get this bad, but the traveling just hit me when I came back and I just didn't do anything for the next week. So again, here's just more clips of the before. The living room is not terrible. The stuff in the corner over there, that's stuff we need to donate, but there's like little piles of trash here. Like not even trash, it's just clutter I need to sort through. So let's begin. I'm gonna start with the laundry since I have so many loads to do and laundry takes kind of a while. So I put one load in the wash and while that's going, I'm gonna go ahead and do the dishes. Does anyone else like organize and stack their dishes before they actually start washing? When there's like a lot of dishes, I feel like that's the easiest way to tackle it. So you stack everything together, the cups and the plates and the bowls all together and then you go in and wash everything. So I hand wash everything. I don't have a dishwasher here in this apartment, which isn't that big of a deal. I really only use a dishwasher to dry my dishes because I've always just hand washed my dishes. Um, but since we don't have a dishwasher for me to dry them, I have this little, um, this little like mini drying rack from Target. So I put it on the opposite side of the sink and I just stack all the clean dishes in there and let it drain and dry and all that kind of stuff. So um, now I have to get all of the pots and pans that I left on the stove, so washing those now. The soap I'm using is from um, Target. Target's new brand called Everspring. I've been using them lately and I really, really like it. They're super affordable, they don't test on animals, and they smell really good. So I've been really liking that brand. So the dishes are done and then now we can move on to cleaning the stove. Now for the stove, I normally try to clean every night like after I cook dinner um, just because it gets messy really quickly. So I always try to wipe it down afterwards but it, I kind of let it build up here so it was getting a little icky. So I had to make sure I wiped and cleaned that down. And once I did that, the laundry was finished so I went ahead, brought that up, and just dumped all the clean clothes on my bed and started sorting and folding everything, folding Johnny's clothes and my clothes. So the laundry honestly took a good portion of today just because I was up and down the stairs, going back to the laundromat, and I had to do so many loads, and I normally don't have to do this much laundry, but because I let it pile up, there was just like an endless amount of laundry I had to do, like, oh my gosh, it was insane. So here is what the room looks like at the moment. I just have Johnny's clothes folded and 
on the side of the bed for him to put away once he gets home. And now I'm gonna work on the bathroom, like the countertop, because it's just a clutter of mess right now. And so I'm sorting through all of my jewelry right now. I keep a lot of them in plastic bags because I don't have like an actual jewelry um, system holder yet. I'm still trying to find something that works and fits in this space. If you guys have any ideas, let me know. This pile of stuff is just giveaway stuff that I need to put away and I'm going to wipe down the counter and oh my gosh it looks so much better I love a clean bathroom so now let's go ahead and move on to my little workspace so this was a DIY desk so that's why it looks so much smaller than a normal size desk but it works perfectly for me and I feel like the bigger my desk the more space I have for clutter so I like that it's really small like this and really only fits my computer and my planner and that's it so I am cleaning up the clutter that I've made here on my table and throwing away the trash and receipts and all that kind of stuff sorting through my stickers making it all nice and clean and I did put my vision board up on the side right there don't know if it will stay there but uh, for now we'll keep it right there next I am going to sweep the house um, this is something I have to do like constantly because of the flooring that we have and because we have Zoe who sheds like crazy so there is always so much dust and hair so I have to sweep literally like every day or every other day so this is me not sweeping for a handful of days so I'm also going to sweep the kitchen area. The only thing I didn't do in this clean with me video is mop the floor and I do have a mop but it sucks like it's not even worth mopping so that's why I, I didn't I didn't mop in this video I just wanted to sweep. Um, we'll mop later when we get a better mop but the mop we have at the moment just sucks so much and the other thing I didn't do is vacuum we don't have a vacuum at the moment I know it's a little gross we've lived here for like over a month now no vacuum <laughs> so I need to grab a vacuum ASAP so I can clean the bedroom carpet but now the kitchen area is done the living room area is done looks so much better I just love a clean space like oh my gosh my mind and my heart it just everything just feels so much better so for the bathroom I actually will hand wipe down the tub we used to scrub like back at my parents house we used to scrub the tub um, to clean it but my apartment complex is pretty strict on the type of cleaning stuff that we use in the tub so I just hand wipe everything and clean the toilet swept in there so the bathroom is good to go so again here is some befores and then I'll show you guys the after but that is basically a day of cleaning just tidying up everything in the house um, like going through the clutter reorganizing everything I just feel so much better now like looking at these before pictures like uh, they like just make me cringe it just makes me so upset looking at that because I can't work and be productive in a space like this so I am so happy that I got to clean and I got to share it with you guys. I hope that this motivated you guys to clean as well. Um, share with me your before and after pictures, whether it's on Instagram or the Little Flower Family Facebook group, whatever you wanna do, Twitter even. Um, I would love to see before and afters because I think it's always like so crazy to see. So again, these are all the before pictures and then we are going to show you the after pictures here shortly. Ugh, look at how clean this is. I love it. So nice and clean. And I cleaned up my vanity. I forgot to show that, but I did clean up and put away my makeup. Ugh, clean bathroom. Love, love, love. No more piles of laundry just on the floor. My workspace is nice and clean, and I got my planner on its little easel. We've swept the floor. We got rid of the clutter on the floor. Oh, the kitchen looks so much better. And then the living room space. And that completes this clean with me video. So that is it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye.